Hello everyone, welcome to Bargain Gaming, where we can play excellent games without busting our wallets. This is episode 101 of Mouth and Blade, Bannerlord. And this is how we're ending up. Uh, I mean, we have to release like all the captured Sturgeon Militia Archer, uh, Sturgeon Militia Spearmen. That's like almost 240 right there, 240. And another 21 uh, recruits, uh, 260 easy. Because we just can't carry too many. Uh, uh, and we're holding all of these guys here. So that's why we cannot... We can barely move. And uh, so, okay. We're throwing away good money. Uh, we can't help it. Because we cannot sell the prisoners here in this... Uh, this They don't have a... Uh, in this castle, they don't have a, a, a merchant or a trade. So this castle is fully developed. So all of them is developed and we don't need to do anything. So we set it on to uh, festival and games and that kind of about even things out. So uh, we're, they're experiencing 18. Right now they're yeah 18, that's fine. But uh, it should not be too bad because uh, uh, we have only 35 people in the you know what? Maybe, uh, yeah, only 35 people in garrison. Um, I don't think it should be problematic. Uh, and that's why, yeah, if we go to the dungeon, we the dungeon can only hold a maximum of 180. We have like uh, Sturgeon, Drushiknik, Champion, 90 of them, and 27 Drushiknik. Uh, like this is a tier six. This is a tier five. This is the noble line, uh, of course. And then we and so these guys, aside from them, Varyag and the Otrox, uh Hopefully, they will come around to us, and uh, we can uh, we can employ them and put them in our uh, what do you call this? Put them in our garrison. So right now, our garrison is very light. Uh, so. Maybe what we can do is... Wow. Why is this burning? Where's our idiot companion? Oh, or was that done by our idiot companion? Where's our idiot companion? Oh, she's over here. Uh, I don't think they can take over the castle, right, with 18 people. Anyway, uh, what we can do is save the game. And then we can go to the, uh, we can go to our, to Revel. Um, and then sell the extra prisoners that we are carrying along with us. And then, uh, we... What I will go through is check through uh, the prisoners that we have and find out uh, what is the best price we can get. Because uh, huh. if we look at, yeah, if we look at the, if we look at the kingdoms and we look at Sturgia, And if we count the number of people, like one, two, three, four, and this is seven, that's 11 plus three, that's uh, 14, right? 14, and then this is 14 minus three, 11. 14 plus 11 is 25. 25, this is 12, 10, uh, this is 11, 25, 36, 36, oh, so they still have a lot of people, oh, this, uh, they have a lot of people out there, this is like 22, so 36, that is 58, 58, Oh, they still have a lot of people out there. Uh, this is uh, 25, 
5878 Okay, so they still have a lot of people out there. Okay, they still have a lot of people out there. Uh, so if uh, let's see if we come over here and oh there is still another guy can 26 besiege the castle Can 36 besiege the castle? Oh, that, it was this guy that was messing the... You know what? Let's load the previous game. Maybe if we go there instead of coming right here we might be able to set, uh, save that settlement that was being harassed or being molested. I don't know. Uh, it doesn't matter. It's just, uh, yeah, because, well, we, we want the income. And if uh, we can destroy him, uh, give up one of the prisoner slots for that person, why not, right? Okay, let's do that. Let's do that. Jeez, I did not realize. I thought, I thought that levels, uh, that party with 16 people is not gonna be able to do the settlement. So I did not realize there was another person there. So, <sighs> thank goodness for save games. And we can take both of them and we can release a couple of more prisoners. Uh, we can take the lords. Uh, prisoners aren't worth much, you know what? Yeah, it, it doesn't matter. Unlike if the settlement is like uh, ransacked. And that's why I don't understand our party, our party leaders. Why are they not protecting that settlement? It's actually being molested. So they should just go there. Uh, man, yeah, sometimes... Uh, <laughs> very frustrating when you think about it I think the um, and yet the AI for the opposition when uh, we are molesting or we are endangering their uh, their parties oh no that guy comes from oh okay 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 so there's no way to save the settlement then okay I guess it's already busted. I mean, you're not going to run. You're not going to get away. So there's no way to save it. I guess it's it's done for. Okay, that's fine. We'll catch both of them. We'll add them to our collection. We need to herd them. Oh, she is too fast for us. Ouch. Okay. Unlike this guy, has no chance. Forgive me for what may seem an abundance of caution. 
I think you just uh, destroyed our village. Attack. Again, I don't want to sacrifice another troop out of this. And hopefully uh, some of those troops that we caught will volunteer to join us so that um, we do have room to house her. <laughs> So these guys are like second, third stringers already. Attack! Oh, they're way on the other, on the right side. Why are you blocking us? That's our own people there. We get a uh, hit in. Ouch! No! Get out of here. Let's wait for stragglers. Uh, stragglers kept try to escape from that mess of uh, that crowded mess. Where is their lady uh, leader? Because she will be wearing good armor. Yeah, I think they got her surrounded and they're tickling her to death. Again, it's up against... Look at that. Oh, that's the banner right there. Look at that banner uh, waving. <laughs> What? Where are they going? Did she suddenly port it out of there? What happened? Yeah, why? Why? I don't understand. Yeah, where did they? Why did they start ri riding away? <laughs> really don't know how to uh, gauge how the AI works um, you know why is it our AI AI that guides our party members are really idiotic theirs are not oh prisoners okay uh, let's see if there's anybody who ooh, okay let's us uh, Level them up. Anybody joined us? The another Otrox, come on, join us. You're not gonna regret it. Yes, yes. Woodsman? Maybe not. Okay. Uh I uh, will accept anyone at this point in time. Okay, right? Uh, because we want to staff up our our garrison. Where is this? Uh, okay, uh, and then let's get the... Hunter, Varyag, Soldier, Otrok, and Sturgeon Warrior. I think let's get the Otroks. And then let's see who we can uh, release. Uh, 
are there any recruits in here oh let's release the militia uh sturgeon warrior or woodsman let's really let's get the i don't want a woodsman i think woodsman turn into um They turn into archers. Yeah, they turn into range units. Okay, 230 prisoners. Okay. And of course, the uh, AI game cheats because, uh, like, right now they have no castles, they have nothing, and yet uh, their lords are always well armed, uh, and then they will soon form a party of like 40 or 50. <sighs> You received 6,772. Oh, because, uh, what do you call this? Uh, one of our uh, governors uh, won the tournament. Finally, that idiot uh, came came here. No, he parked himself in uh, Reville. Did you see that? The guy parked himself in Reville. Uh, let's attack again. Let's not again potentially lose troops again let's just yeah I, I don't believe in a simulation and our tactics is not high enough so uh, yeah I think we what we can do is um, get a bunch of them! oh these are these are Mitaras people. Ah, oh, we gave them a bunch of, I think, archers, right? Yeah, yeah, we gave them a bunch of mid mid level archers. <laughs> so I was wondering, where did those archers come from? Where's the enemy? Forget that person. Let's come here. Did the Lord go? We got her, and she is wearing uh, wearing one of those round shields. We are such a bully. <laughs> okay. Okay, we're picking a... She's only like a third stringer. And... Um, 
Huh. You know, let's talk to all of them and maybe uh, we can find uh, Ganimo's a wife. Uh, no, we have... I think we're maxed out on prisoners. Otrok becomes Varyag. Okay. Cataphrac. Yep, two one. Oh, we can, we can, uh, we can take two more. Varya veteran. Okay, let's hold off until. Yeah, no, no. Let's just let's just take him. Let's just take him. Yeah, we are running out of space. Uh, okay, let's get the. Varya. Do what the writer. Two thirty two. Okay, we're maxed out. We're maxed out, right? I think yeah, we're maxed out. Two thirty two. Oh, how come we did not oh, I think uh Mitara got her, I mean the prisoner? Okay, that's fine. We've been trying to make our way to reveal for quite some time now. <laughs> oh boy. Okay. Uh, wow. Both villages was ransacked. Ouch. Because we have idiots for companions. Unlike here, we were able to protect this one. Okay. Um. Go to the keep. Go to the dungeon. Manage the prisoners. Right, we're gonna give everything t into prison. Right, okay. Set everybody into prison. Uh, over here, there must be some excess people that uh, went in together with the lords. So, two Varya veterans. Look at these guys. A whole bunch of jokers. Okay. Um, then let's go to our garrison. We have, oh, we have 161 people now. Okay, we'll put in the veteran, the Varyag, the two Otroks. All right, okay, I think, I think we're good. I think we're good. Uh, no, garrison is now minus two. Okay, let us uh, remove the looters. Yeah, I don't think we can afford that many people. Okay, garrison is still plus one. Okay. Uh, wait, let us make sure we don't have... any of the lords when we sell these guys. Right, we don't need any of these guys, okay. Oh, I want to check, uh, before we sell these guys, 
I want to check the tree first uh, for the um, troops. Let's say um, cavalry, right? For sturgeons, for sturgia, and the Drusnik champion. The line is Otrok, Varyag. Oh, Varyag veteran. Okay. Uh, and then from Varyag veteran, then they become Drusnik. Okay. So I think we can change out the Otroks that we have, and then we change them to Varyag veterans wherever. So, yeah. The prison that we, yeah, we will, okay, let's do that. Okay. Um, so I think from Varyag veteran to Druziknik, to, to Driders, uh, is when we have to supply the horse. Okay, let's keep the Varyag veterans. Wow, these horse raiders, these are... That's a lot of troops that we can give to our uh, companion leaders. <sighs> okay, let's keep the Varyags. How about the Karkigit riders? You know what? Hmm... Maybe let's just maybe instead of because those those guys we cannot um, we cannot we cannot hire them unless we capture them. So I don't know how good those guys are. Oh no, you know what? No, let's just get rid of them. We don't need them. These guys we know can turn into Dushik, Dushishnik, whatever that his name is. Uh, okay, we'll keep those guys. Um, surgery, okay. Okay, there are no lords here, okay. And then, uh, after this, what I'm going to do is I'm going to sift through the, uh, prisoners. And then I'll have, like, five prisoners at a time that I can go talk to. And then find out who will offer us the best price. Uh, because I want to... I don't want, you know, they can be pests. They can be upsetting our settlement, so maybe uh, pissing out with them is better, even if they are really no threat, except that they will just constantly harass our settlement. Uh, if we have four companions out there, um, or maybe it's it would be a good idea to have four companions out there uh, protecting our settlements and training them up by going after the sturgeons, and we hold on to the sturgeon nobles that we currently have in our uh, possession. So that means they will never be a major threat. And um, anyway, um, oh, those are th more thoughts I, I'm just thinking. Anyway, uh, our timer went off, so I guess this would be a good place to uh, cut the episode right here. Thank you guys for joining me. I hope you join me in the next episode. Bye.